Good day, good day! How the fuck are ya? This is your friend Dan O, and this is Roverland, the YouTube channel that's anything and everything Land Rover. Have I got a video for you today? All right, all right, all right. We got a one on Wednesday. Now, it, uh, take a look. Well, we got uh, more than one, but we got just one. <laughs> and once again, special thank you to Drone. And he is uh, the one that has sent that big, huge box and was still working on going through. Uh, check out his YouTube channel, Chasing Diecast Cars YouTube channel. He's out of Belgium, Europe. And uh, man, I, he sent me this huge box and uh, I'm trying to take time and really appreciate what he sent by going through and uh, picking out uh, things and taking a look at it. And uh, uh, we might be halfway through, might be halfway through of all the stuff you sent me. It, it was a crazy gift that he sent me. And uh, uh, yeah, we're, uh, we're gonna be trying to uh, finish up and uh, you know, speckle it here and there with a lot of different stuff. So today on a one on Wednesday, we're talking about Burrigo and uh, he, he sent me two Burrigos and one of the Street Fire 143rd scale and one of the Land Rover Defender 110 and uh, two different, totally different um, styles and, and models of Burrigo. Now, um, I don't really know too much about Burgo other than uh, they are a Italy designed uh, company and I have had, uh, uh, we have had Burgos on this channel before. Um, this is kind of what uh, I got from Walmarts uh, here in the States many, many, many years ago were these kits and uh, then I would I would find some of these uh, that were already done uh, on eBay and stuff like that. But there's two of the kits, and we're going to try to kind of take a look at um, each one of these and um, just about um, you know what what each one is. Now uh, I think now I know that this uh, Burgo is a uh, street fire. I know that I can buy these, this packaging, this um, series, this Street Fire, I can buy them at uh, my local dollar store, Dollar General, which is, uh, uh, they have a lot of uh, different things. Now, the only problem is, and and I look at the boxes, uh, they, they come in a sleeve, I think there's like eight of them, and there's four and four, and they come in a sleeve, and they, they bust open the box, and they just sell them like that. The problem is, is they never have the Land Rovers in the mix. They're all um, Dodge and Fords and, and um, stuff like that. They never have just Land Rovers in them. So I'm really kind of uh, excited and uh, this one here is not taped so we should be able to uh, crack this one open so let's uh, see if we can gingerly get this to um, to open up and uh, we can take a look at it um, unboxed yeah so we're just gingerly trying to get in here and open it uh, equally parts here there we go, perfect. We didn't damage anything. Now, from what I found, <clears throat> this one here in the 143rd scale um, is what they call a, um, and let's see, oh wow, that's got some weight to it. Um, yes, so they call this an LRX Concept 143rd. And so it's kind of like the, Land Rover Evoke uh, Dynamic, you know, and uh, so I don't know if it was before they really um, were able to get the Land Rover Evoke uh, badging and things like that squared away, but that's what it looks like. Now, 
Um, like I say, the, the last time we had a little bugger like this, it was the Freelander, uh, pretty much the same size, 143rd scale. And uh, these always had little, the little itty bitty wheels. They could have done a little bit bigger wheel on uh, the uh, Freelander, and uh, which is a really cool, cool little car. But uh, like I say, yeah, they could have gone a little bit bigger uh, with the tires. Matter of fact, you can see uh, it would have been nice to have that wheel well filled right up like with this this new one here. So yeah, so I, I am just totally excited to have this in my collection. Thank you very much, Jerome. So we've got a big Land Rover on the hood. It has that uh, Evoke look to it. I, I'm pretty sure that that's what, you know, this is really uh, modeled after. Now, it does have a weird kind of a, a roof line there uh, with the bracing and, and stuff like that. But this is uh, black with the silver roof. Now, they also made a red one with the silver part black and then a white on white one. But... Uh, like I say, I've never ever gotten one of these in uh, my stores. Uh, the, the, the store is called Dollar General, and they sell them. Like I say, they sell the street, the street fires, but they never sell um, any Land Rovers. So this is really kind of nice. Uh, let's see if we can get in focus here. Yeah. So it says, what does it say there? Land Rover design on that uh, rear bump or the uh, rear license plate. I think that's what that says, doesn't it? Yeah, Land Rover design. Look at that. The LRX. I like that LRX uh, font there. And then on the uh, left, it has the uh, Land Rover badge there, kind of a little miscued. But uh, Land Rover on there, uh, very, very cool. I, I really like that. That is awesome. Uh, lens details in the back snap right in there. Very cool. No opening parts or anything like that. Solid um, uh, uh, sealed uh, windshield, but then it does have uh, land or uh, lens details on the front as well. And they look a little like there might be some yellow tint to it. So I don't know if they have a, a yellow uh, turn signal or something in there that's uh, colored and then they put that snap that uh, clear um, thing on there but really nice left hooker uh, was that five seater four four seats comfortably four seater so just a really nice and it just it's uh, you know it's a toy and uh, they marketed it. it's not really a model it's more or less a toy and uh, so it really rolls really good so very very awesome to to get that, like I say, uh, in that uh, street, um, uh, street fire, and I'm not really sure why they call it street fire because none of them are on fire. But anyway, <laughs> the next one that I want to take a quick look at is this one here, and this is like a really cool, um, just an awesome awesome uh display this is really awesome this is really kind of i would say top shelf for burrigo uh they have the licensing for land rover they did this land rover defender 110 and it's just very sharp packaging not not uh, the the run-of-the-mill type packaging so i'm not really sure if this is like a collector series or or they got just um uh, a added added um, something but th this is a 147th scale and uh, really kind of cool and it comes out now this one is taped so that's about as far as they're gonna go there but we can get it out here now look at this it's got the rubber wheels it's got lens in uh, details on the on the winch on, on the uh, headlights the turn lights are uh, marker lights are painted silver and red defender on the hood so this is a regular defender uh, left hooker again nice bright red 
uh, die cast body with um, what looked like rubber tires. So very, very nice. Oh, look at this. It's got that traditional Defender uh, uh, spare cover on it. I always like that cover on there. Uh, tail lens is on the back with the, once again on the left, it's got the uh, license plate uh, light there. Backup light, brake light, turn signals, uh, marker lights, very, very nicely done. Uh, kind of a canopy type cover on the back with the second row seats with uh, jump seats in the middle. And just, it, I thought it was maybe this one here, but this is a Series 3, and uh, it is definitely a different model uh, and an upgraded model. Very, very cool. Very, very nice. Just about the same size, though, but uh, uh, very nicely upgrade to it. Um, just, just very cool. A, a Defender. A true Defender. So, really kind of cool. I really like this. And now... Once again, go over there. I'm going to flash this one more time as we get out of here. Chasing, chasing diecast uh, cars, YouTube channel, uh, drone. I thank you once again. We're going to get out of here. Thanks for joining me for another one of Wednesday with a Burgo look. And uh, wow, yeah, just awesome. All right, remember, slow traffic, keep right, and have a great Rover day.